Welcome to another episode of Carbs in Reckless Eating. I'm sure I sit in the car. And BS, welcome to be Carbs. Matt Tyne here. We have two days of Red Robin goodness. Oh God, wrong picture. <laughs> oh no, no. First thing we're doing is one of their brand new burgers for uh, Oktoberfest. Even though we're well after it, they're still serving the burger, so I'm gonna try to post this as soon as possible. This is the Uber burger. Flame grilled half pound black Angus burger topped with candied bacon, grilled bratwurst and onions, glazed in Samuel Adams Oktoberfest and drizzled with Merlux beer cheese on a handmade pretzel bun with shredded romaine lettuce and beer mustard. Yum. I love that they got their little catchphrase in there. The only thing I took off was the actual lettuce because gross. I did keep on uh, the onions, which I normally would remove, and the reason I did is because they are actually gimmicked. I mean, these aren't just regular onions, you know, they're doing the Samuel Adams thing with them. So uh, yes, I, I agree that the taking those off would change the taste of the burger, so I will not take them off. I will not take them off, Sam I am. Also subscribe to our gaming channel, Zion Mainframe Gaming, by clicking the annotation right there. We're doing some WWE 2K15 Let's Play weird stuff with our characters battling each other. All right, so this is what the bad boy looks like. Oh God, it is, it is not holding well together. All right, there you go. Oh, it's so hot. Oh, fingers are on fire. Fingers are on fire. The bun, see right there, is really good looking. It's like a pretzel bun going on. So uh, yeah, let's try this thing out. Hopefully these onions are not the type of onions that I, I hate. Uh, hopefully they don't have a huge crunch to them. The Uber Burger, does it live up to the name? It's an awesome name. Let's try this thing out. Onion chop, a little crunchy. It's got a really good flavor, so it's okay. It's a little dry. I would, uh, I would like to have a little more sauce put on this thing, but it doesn't look like there's really any at all. I'm trying to get a bite with the uh, bratwurst in there too. The candied bacon is amazing. It's really good. Flavor-wise, it's great. There's tons of flavor. You can just really capture every little bit, such as, I mean, the meat itself. The onions have a good flavor. The bacon is just so good. But the bratwurst also stands out. It really does mesh together really well. Only thing I'm gonna harp back on is, it's just a little dry. Uh, normally at Red Robin, they put a lot of sauce on, but this time it just kind of, it kind of feels like you could use a little something extra on there to make it a perfect burger. I like it a lot as is though. It's really good, especially with the onions on it. I don't really taste the onions, which is good. You just get a little crunch, which is usually my pet peeve, but the flavor makes up for that. I would rate this thing a low five. <laughs> Not their best burger by far, but most burgers at Red Robin do get that rating anyway. I'm gonna get one more bite. Super tasty burger, well worth the time. Like I said, I will try my best to post this uh, as soon as possible so that you will have time to actually go ch check it out. I wanna try the bacon on its own real quick. Mmm, the bacon is amazing. Well, there you go guys. What are your thoughts on this bad boy? If you've had it before, let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. And if not, I'm always curious to hear things you'd like to see me try from Red Robin. So let me know that as well, requests. Put, put them and fulfill them in your innermost sanctum of fantasies. Mad Zion here saying stay tuned tomorrow for another review for Red Robin. We'll see you then.